Well, in this dev diary, we're going to be talking about two more Warframes. We're going to be talking about Excalibur, which is one of the starting Warframes, and Rhino, which is our biggest, most brutish Warframe. The easiest way to start with Excalibur is to say it's the one that people have seen on the wallpaper, oh, on yes. trailers, yep. on basically... He's the poster boy. There's yep. Slash Dash, which is your starter one. Yep. I was with, we were playing around the office. I had no idea who I was playing with. It was all right. new people. And it was like, you could hear the Grenier dog men behind the door, like that. And so they we're waiting, the doors opening up, and then everyone had the same thought at the same time. And all and four of us went <laughs> and slashed out. Yeah. And there's like eight of yeah, them because you're murdered charging in a like second. Light speed with your sword. But like everyone just, had that same yeah. kind of anticipation. Like, I know what to do here, which is yeah. awesome. Yeah. And then the power jump, I think, from people's feedback on the YouTube channel right. and stuff. It's like, power drop's my favorite, or I thought those seconds is so cool. It does look really cool. Yeah. Like leaping up and then following it up with a roll because you have the momentum. Yeah. You just feel really, well, you feel ninja yeah. Is, is yeah. the word. Yeah, I don't use it a ton, but it's awesome when you're going and it's like, okay, here's the exit to this room on your mini map. You're like, oh, I know how to get up there. And yeah. then off you go. Part of the map, so yeah. Which is awesome. Yeah because you, it goes in a radius, a big bright flash, everyone's like, like that, and then you can just go in and just start. It's awesome for the melee combat of the game. Yeah. Plus you're, you're casting it like He-Man, you're like, <laughs> and it's like, the, yeah. you know, the light of, of the world is shining, yeah. you know, it's really cool. Yeah. Reception for that one was like, what did that character just do? Yeah. But that it was the rhino, and the yeah. rhino, that's not the only thing he has. This one was originally just called Stasis, I think, but the rhino stomp power. Oh, where yeah. you're playing against the horde enemy, and like the door opens up, and everyone gets murdered. So then, like, okay, let's try that <laughs> again. And you guys got in the elevator, down you go, door opens up, and then suddenly everyone's ready. Jeff like walks them all and stays with them all, and then you guys are going in and slashing them to bits. Oh yeah. Uh, it's the sort of improvisational play and like saving those powers for like just the right moment. Yeah. yeah. In yeah. fact, I was playing with him just this morning, just testing out yes. uh, the mini map changes, and Scott came in and he's just watching me play, and I'm just like, and they're just exploding, yeah. exploding, yeah. and then Scott's like. It's better when they just explode, right? Because they just were ragdolling. And yeah. Like, yes, a billion times better. Because <laughs> yeah. they just turn into like red dust when you well, crush them. It makes sense. It is a rhino charging. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty it's... awesome. The rhino skin one is pretty good too. Oh yeah, yeah. popping yep. on and yeah. basically yep. in. I mean, I, I can't help but think of you know comic characters I love that you know, power up. Yeah. It's such a simple ability that it, you know you know what it is immediately. People yeah. around you know what it is, and visually you can really make it look really cool and unique. Uh, and it, it just fits Rhino perfectly. Yep. Yeah.